I'm Jimmy. And I'm John. Today's episode of Jimmy and John is Cardi. John, explain to us what Cardi is. Since this week is the wild card week, we decided that we are going to be carding the teams who lost this week. Well, let's get started. Our first team to be carded is the Chiefs, who lost 22 to 21 against the Titans. Marcus Marietta led, led the Titans to three touchdowns in the second half to come back from a 21 to three deficit. And as Marcus Marietta curb stomped the Chiefs in the second half and he completed a pass to himself, he threw the ball, hit the defender's hands and he caught it and dove for a touchdown. Which is pretty impressive because I'm pretty sure that's like the first time that's ever happened in NFL history. And uh, as Marcus Marietta did that, the Chiefs fell back in the basement and proved to us that they are not playoff contenders as a whole organization. Which is a valid reason for why they should be carded. Alright, and our second team to be carded is the Rams, who lost... 13 to 26 against the Falcons. Matt Ryan showed the upstart of the LA, the LA Rams what playoff poise is, as he jack slapped the Rams and ripped their horns off throughout the game with their most powerful O, which is a Valerie's for why they should be carded. And our third team to be carded here is the Bills, who lost 10 to 3 against the Jaguars. As Blake Bortles ran a track meet this past week to outrun the Bills and send the b send the Bills back home. Oh, we have a FaceTime call coming from Pedro. The Bills suck. Um, okay. Thank you, Pedro. <laughs> Thanks. But anyway. Uh, the Bills fall back into the pit of misery as all of the Bills fans who jump off high trucks into foldable tables all will remain in the hospital. So that is a valid reason for why they should be carded. Alright, and our fourth team here, and final team, to be carded is the Panthers, who lost 31-26 to against the Saints. Drew Brees himself destroyed the Panthers, and he threw two, he threw two touchdowns, 324 yards. It was a complete game for Drew Brees, and his dominant performance sent the Panthers running back to Carolina with their tail between their legs, as their defense could not stop Drew Brees or Alvin Kamara, the rookie. For that is a valid reason for why they should be Cardi. Now, we have an announcement. Cam Newton assumingly had a concussion, as he couldn't even like see where he was walking. He had to have people help him off the field. But he returned to play after the Panthers didn't really do anything about a concussion, because they knew that if Cam Newton didn't play, they're going to be in a heck of a trouble. So, as Cam Newton finished the game, the Panthers violated concussion protocol, and they are probably going to be facing some big charges. Well, that's about it for this video. Like and subscribe. And we'll send this video out on a good note. I'm Jimmy. And I'm John. Peace.